That is making me want to fucking have a rave right here and right now, I'll tell you what. Excuse me, do you know where the MDMA store is? I don't know, I'm afraid, no. Okay, that's all right. He doesn't know where the MDMA store is, maybe someone else will. There's actually one pence pieces in the UK. Why do you need one penny, ever? I mean, we're a bunch of backward cunts in Australia, but we got rid of this shit in like the early 90s. I'll fucking see you in hell, cunt! You're one pence short. One pence short. One pence, okay, I'll be back. Oh, there's that fucking penny. I think this is, is this the bush I threw it in? Or fucking hell! Where's the penny? A pair of school shoes there. I don't even want to open this bin in case fucking Maddie McCann's in there. Oh, that's just some other kid. All good. Some other kid, it's not Maddie. They bloody love football in the UK. I'll give you the hot tip. Look, they've just got these giant novelty balls just that, you know, anyone can go up and play with. That's a fucking great initiative. Gareth Bale on the wing, moving in. Fuck! Fuck! Oh, fuck! They're calling for the sub. The Scottish haggis in a can. I feel like I need to get the bomb squad to come and get that off the shelf for me. Look at that. Oh, nah. Nah, fuck that. Some of the artwork in the UK is just, is on point. I'll tell you what, look at someone here has made a bust of, um, of Seal, the singer-songwriter. That's just fucking really well done. Even the, all the fucking shit in his face, that's really well done. Oh, look at that Batman. That is so cute. You know, he, he'd probably have a hard time arresting Bane, but still, that's fucking... Although there's some criminals, you know, he'd probably have a pretty easy time apprehending Jared from Subway. Come on, Batman, hey, arrest me, no worries, just arrest me up here. There you go, come on, come on, Batman, I'm, I'm, I'm in trouble, Batman. How sexual is this, this dentist sign? I just walked in there, I just said, hey, just a hand job, please, and yeah, maybe, maybe a head job as well. And they, and they said, no, mate, we're working on your teeth and stuff. I'm like, well, change your fucking sign. Oh, look at that. A little red phone booth. Do people use the phone boxes still? This is so cute, I don't know. Oh, fuck, they do. They sh People shit and pissing them. Yeah, quite often, um, you know, people will come up and they'll grab a photo with me here in the UK if they recognise me. And um, sometimes there's some oldies that see that happening, and they, they'll come over and they say, who, "Who are you? What do you do?" And I'll tell them I'm Dr. Carl from Neighbours, and I'm looking for fucking Valium. And sometimes when I'm really in the mood, I'll tell them I'm Didier Drogba, and I just I just laugh at them going home and googling Didier Drogba and going, "Is it him? I I think it is." Look at this, it's Dobby's Cocktail Garden. Imagine that. Come in, hey, can we want a cocktail from Dobby? Yeah, you want the sluts to be drunk? Well, come in, Dobby will sort you out, Mr. Potter. Oh, look, the Royal Bank of Scotland. How absolutely lovely. This was the biggest bank in the world, uh, briefly, before the 2008 crash. And hey, just a quick suggestion. Instead of asking for a $40 billion bailout, how about you try selling your fucking fence first, or even your solid gold plaque up there? Or, I don't know, maybe hiring one less gardener. There's your $40 billion right there, you fucking daft cunts. Greedy bunch of fucks.